This video will show you how to search across multiple EBSCO databases, which will help increase your search results. We've logged into CINAHL Complete, but if we click Choose Databases at the top, we can now select additional EBSCO databases. So for example, Medline is also particularly useful for nursing and health. It's a big medical clinical database, much larger than CINAHL, which is nursing and allied health. PsychInfo is also particularly good for nursing and health related subject areas. It covers psychology journals, so particularly good for mental health. So I can select as many of these as I want to. We could also include the generic academic search premier as well if we wanted to. But otherwise, if I keep these three, I'm searching across the three key health databases. At this point, I would again recommend you go to the advanced search screen and you can see we are now searching across three different databases. The previous video showed running this search purely within CINAHL. If I now run the search with these same keywords in Medline and PsychInfo, you can see our search results have increased greatly. We would still need to add the filters, so we can still look at the last 10 years. When we searched CINAHL, we limited it to peer review journal articles. However, because we're now searching Medline, everything in Medline is already peer reviewed, so that filter doesn't exist. So if you do go to show more and click peer review, it will remove the Medline results. So I would recommend you click academic journals, which does a similar search. So this is now bringing back higher quality academic journals. We can also limit it by language as well if we wanted to. So I can click English here. As we scroll down further, you can see it will tell you how many results it's found from each of those databases. So the largest number was actually from PsychInfo, which is the psychology database, and that's because we're particularly looking at mental health. Medline and then CINAHL have the lowest number out of the three. This is useful because we can search three databases all in one go. We've now got a set of results coming back. We can change our page options to 50 to page. This enables us to get through our results a lot quicker. To get our results down to make it easier for us to browse through, we can limit it by field. I have previously warned against doing this because you could remove some key papers, but just for the purposes of getting through the results here, I'm going to say I only want articles that have teenagers in the title and also mental health. We're now down to 93. The reason for showing this is looking at duplicates. Across the three databases, there will be duplicates, but the database will remove them for you. However, you won't get to see the unique number with the duplicates removed until you go to the final page of results. So as I go to page two now, you can see the results are down to 71. So this is giving us the unique number with the duplicates removed. 